I just did another episode with a real estate broker I have been regularly checking in with since the pandemic to keep up with all the gyrations in the local housing market. For the first time in all these years, he told me he sees DFW as a buyer's market now because he and colleagues that he networks with have been seeing fewer bidding wars. He's also seen buyers going over the asking price in fewer occasions and far more homes for sale out there. And for the first time in a long time, he's seeing a big increase in the number of sellers who are lowering their asking prices. Now, I know buyers' prices are still up there, and so are interest rates, and striking an affordable deal can still be tough. But because of all of that, real estate broker Joe Atkins says buyers may still benefit. You see, earlier this year, there was a seismic court settlement that is changing how real estate agent commissions are determined and who pays them. For a long time, it was traditional for for the home seller to pay all of the commission, which would then be split up between the buyer's agent and the seller's agent. Well, now the new way will allow for the buyer to negotiate their own fee to their agent and the same thing for the seller. But Atkins says that even with the change, he thinks that much will still be staying the same. Given where interest rates are, prices, it's hard enough for buyers to come up with just the down payment itself. So then now if you're going to quote unquote try to burden a buyer with now having to come out of pocket to pay their buyer's agent, I mean, chances are they're not going to buy, they're going to have to buy less house, which means that takes your house off the table that they could have afforded if you would have, you know, been willing to pay the buyer's agent. Additionally, he notes that if you're selling and other sellers near you are willing to pay the whole commission, but you're not, uh, buyers might naturally look at the others first. Still, it's about to be a whole new world out there with new options, so we'll see what happens. For more, you can follow me and check out my article today posted at Jason Wheeler TV on Facebook X and Threads, where we're always right on the money.